so guys, let's take a look at the Italian, Spanish and French part from the art collection at the beautiful museum. start with the Italian collection. Most Italian painters, they worked for the Austrian court, so for the Habsburg family. This was one of the very famous empress at the time, Maria Theresia. Here on top is a very nice, beautiful painting from Canaletto. The view still today, after 300 years, almost the same. There's of course always some royal family members, some kings, some princes, mostly Italian painters. Look at this one here from Giordano, Archangel Michael. Over there, probably one of the famous ones from Caravaggio. You can see the darkness on the back. Also here, one lookalike from Saraceni, also quite interesting. So you see they really love the Italians. A few famous here from Veronese. We have here exposition about Beethoven. We're celebrating 250 years. There's a special exposition here. It is the exit, so there is a other way to the entrance. Usually we're gonna go left, but because of the exposition, we have to make a round, so we're going here right. Still Italian art. Now we're entering the Spanish part of the exposition. This is quite a famous one from Diego Velasquez. Do you remember Spain? was for a long time also Austrian territory. So Charles V, Carlos V, Carlos V was from the Habsburg family. More Italians. So beautiful collection. And 
here we have our small part French painters. And here we're coming back. So usually I don't do like a quick tour like this one. If you like, of course I can do it, show you the highlights of this nice museum. But usually I go step by step and tell some stories, tell some details. Also, I have good contacts to art historian. So if you're into painting, if you really want to know really little details of the paintings, I have the right connection and show you all this nice, beautiful art here. So, when in Vienna, you may have a look inside this nice, beautiful museum. Have a great time. Bye-bye.